All right, here we are, 1984 XR80. Uh, have difficulty starting, it will not start. Uh, it does pop through the carburetor uh, occasionally. To me, that's an indication that it's firing late. So I disassembled the uh, top of the motor here to look at the cam timing. And I took out the spark plug. And I noticed that the spark plug was already on the down stroke, the intake stroke. And the exhaust valve was still open. So that tells me that the timing, the cam timing is late. So I uh, took the flywheel cover off and the valve cover. And if you can notice, the two bolts holding the top cam, the top cam sprocket on, those are supposed to be flush, horizontal, parallel with the top of the head. And you'll see that front bolts, the shinier of the two, is higher than the back one. So I'm going to, it's a 10 millimeter, I'm going to loosen up those two bolts and see if I can get that, uh, that camshaft forward, advanced, maybe one tooth and we'll go from there. All right, I'll check back. All right, we're back. The uh, two bolts have been loosened. The uh, cam gear uh, sprocket slid right off the cam. I was able to uh, drop it down just a hair to get the chain loose enough to uh, rotate it forward one tooth uh, within the chain. And uh, you'll notice that uh, it's at top dead center. Let's see. Let's see if I can get that focused. There's the mark right there. Right there and I just scratched it uh, with the screwdriver so I knew the mark I didn't have a paint stick and I'm too lazy to go get one anyways uh, and you'll notice now that it is uh, at the horizon of the top of the uh, cylinder head uh, this is where it was previously uh, at top dead center um, so it was a little a little uh, early or late now it's now it's early right on time and uh, it's got good spark, good compression. I'm guessing she should fire right up. So I'll check back. Okay, Pete. Here we go, buddy. Uh, I just buttoned it up. I just put the coil back on. I put the uh, valve cover back on, spark plug in. I dropped it, and it closed the gap. So I just, you know me, I took a fucking spatula and opened up the gap. Uh, super high tech. Um, the magna, the magneto cover still off, gas tank still off. There's fuel in the, in the car. I have not kicked it yet. I just assembled it. Now I know my Honda's buddy, and I'm gonna guess it's gonna pop just like that. I can't wait to see this for you to see this video. So let's see, choke on, yeah, choke on. Here we go, buddy. It didn't pop like I thought. Hmm. I don't know. Here we go. Still. Still feels a little backfiry. Kind of questioning why the uh, why the cam was retarded, anyways. Oh ho! <laughs> this fucking thing. I'm gonna have a heart attack kicking this thing. Ow! Oh, that was it almost. It's got a weird squeak. What the fuck? Wow, why is it fucking bucking my leg down? All right, I'll come back to this. 
<sighs> All right, here we go. Take two. All right, so here's Pete. This is what I did. I did the timing, and it was still popping, but I push started it and almost got it. So I figured, okay, something going on in the flywheel with the timing. So I pulled the flywheel, and the wood rip key is sheared. So that uh, the flywheel spun on the crankshaft, throwing the timing off. Now, I don't have a woodruff key, but just to try it, I carefully lined up the woodruff key slots from the crank to the flywheel and just snugged it down. Now, I already cheated. I already kicked it. Here we go. Yeah, buddy. Love it. See, so what's, I see what's going to happen here. Oh, uh, the choke was on. Let's see. Yeah, see what's happening? Is um, the first time I started it, it fired right up and idled. I shut it off. And then I just started it again. I think the flywheel is actually slipping on the crank and throwing the timing off. Kind of like trying to start a Chevy 350 with a loose distributor. That's what we got going on here. So anyways... That's it, buddy. I feel confident I got it. So uh, I'm going to stop at Honda. Right There's a Honda right by my work. And I'm going to grab a Woodruff key. Uh, flat on the top, round on the bottom. Looks like a, looks like a moon. And uh, we'll go from there. All right. That's it.